Now the question here is identify the type of the bacteria shown in the given figure. So uh, you can see certain spores and we'll just try to focus on one of these. So if you see here, it looks like a bacteria in which a head is there of course and then there is a flagella, right? The tail is there. So if we just try to understand uh, the uh, morphological structure of the uh, flagellated bacteria like Vibrio. So these are generally coma shaped bacteria. Okay, these are coma shaped bacteria. And here we'll be able to see that they have one cell membrane. Then there will be cell wall. And then there will be a capsule as well. These are the ribosomes. And since these are prokaryotes, so it will be your nucleoids. These are the lateral flagellas lateral flagellas and these small ones are the pili and this will be your flagellum okay so basically this is a polar bacteria having flagella on the single pole okay so that is going to be the structure of the uh, coma shaped vibrios okay now if we just talk about the coma shaped vibrios in detail, so these bacteria are generally 1.5 to 4 micrometer in size. So this is the size of these bacteria. These are of course gram negative bacteria, gram negative bacteria, coma shaped bacteria. They have polar flagella. And since they have flagella, so they will be motile for sure. So these are motile bacteria. Okay. They are sheathed. That means they have capsule on the surface or on their outer body. Okay. And they are generally, these type of bacteria are generally rigid and curved and actively motile as we have already discussed. So these are rigid, curved and actively motile so these are the various features of these bacteria that's why these are known as the vibrios now if we just uh, talk about the structure of the staphylococcus so we know they are arranged in grape like structures and the streptococcus are also arranged in uh, chain like structures okay so these are the various differentiations here but it is very crystal clear from the figure itself or the slide step that uh, the bacteria is a coma shaped bacteria and hence the answer vibrio that is option 1 is correct. If we just go through the important points of the vibrio, so of course morphology of the vibrio, so V. cholerae is generally coma shaped and 2 to 4 micrometer long and it is actively motile and that is done by polar flagellum. Okay. And if we try to cultivate this bacteria for long, okay, so it may become straight road like and then you can see uh, that these are, uh, they look like gram negative bacteria which are bacillus, okay, so gram negative enteric bacteria like shape that can occur if it is cultivated for a prolonged period of time. So coming back to the option, yes, option one is correct.